is a compilation of virtual learning environments built by Brant Knudsen over the last four years. In the foreground is HKU Medicine Island. I have set up several student training areas, including biochemistry lab procedures and histopathology lab safety. This is the histopathology laboratory. This is designed to use a HUD or heads up display. And you can see that the equipment was based on real world equipment and photographs. This is a quick demonstration of the lab fire safety training. Oh no, the ethanol bottle cap was off and the fumes have ignited a small fire. What should you do? Take a choice using the HUD. That's correct. If a small fire happens and you feel confident you can put it out without risk to yourself, use the fire extinguisher. Oh no, the alcohol bottle has fallen over and it's lighting up a safety hazard, a pile of boxes that should not have been stored there. Choice two, time to run away. Get out. And out the door he goes. So normally this would be a first person student experience. And don't forget to hit the fire alarm. Also located in the medicine building is a five patient ward where medical students can practice doing research, patient interviews, and diagnosis. Using an avatar to navigate through the virtual environment helps students build a feeling of immersion, a presence that they're actually in that environment. This uh, patient history is a Google document which students can page through and this can be easily updated externally from the virtual environment. Time to look at a video patient interview. My name is Diabetes. I am 26 years old. Hmm. Something to think about. The Medicine Building also hosts a replica of the Innovative Learning Center by the Hong Kong Jockey Club. Good morning and welcome to the Hong Kong Jockey Club Innovative Learning Center for Medicine. My name's Sophia, and your timing is perfect. We are able to simulate several clinical environments in this center, including the ward, the operating theater, and the outpatients department. The first of these is the ward. Here we can say hello to a mother and her newborn on the labor ward, and yes, this obstetric mannequin can actually give birth. Adjacent to the labor ward, we have an intensive care unit. This high fidelity simulator has many features, including the ability to blink, speak and cry. I hope you have enjoyed this virtual tour of our center. Next door is the HKU Education Island, where I'm exploring gamified educational experiences. This is the Nautilus, Captain Nemo's submarine. The third island is Lingnan Drama Island which has a complete replica of a medieval village, complete with castle and horses. This area hosts the Quest, which is a series of 10 challenges for student self-learning. Another facility is the Virtual Classroom. This is designed to be an introductory activity, very similar to a face-to-face -face classroom experience. Instructors can display a slideshow, narrate it using their voice. 27 students each have their own laptop, which they can use to display the slides at their own pace. Another virtual classroom environment is that of a kindergarten. This is useful for training teachers to deal with student behavioral issues.
This build is based on Dickens' classic Victorian tale, A Christmas Carol. Christmas humbug? Uncle, you don't mean that. What else can I be when I live in such a world of fools as this? Merry Christmas. Students can use a magic door which transports them to the next scene. In life, I was your partner, Jacob Marley. <laughs> Students interact with the scene by clicking on the characters to hear the key lines. You will be haunted by three spirits. Three magic doors offer students the choice of going to the Christmas past, Christmas present, or the Christmas future. This bill was designed to let students actively explore through the key scenes of this classic story. The key scenes were created within a larger setting, in this case, a snowy town. Students can walk around, view the different parts of the area, and find the key scenes here marked with red signs. The ghost of Christmas past has brought Scrooge to relive his memories of Fezziwig's ball. Do you know this place? It is time for <laughs> Sir Roger de Coverley! This earth more terrifying to me than a life doomed to poverty. Another idol has replaced me. Students can explore a bit to find the next door, which returns them to the central hub and further explore this story. Christmas present starts with a scene of the Cratchit House and the Christmas feast. The giant ghost of Christmas present confronts Scrooge with Tiny Tim and the family. These scenes are presented in a large snowy town complete with ice skating, And on to the next scene. Here is the marketplace. Another snowy vista. The marketplace is a happy social scene where the townspeople gather to prepare their own Christmas dinners. This is a social life which Scrooge has never been part of. On to the Christmas future. Here, the Cratchit family mourns Tiny Tim. I'm sure none of us will ever forget that poor Tiny Tim. Mama, <laughs> oh, no. oh, please don't be great. Are these the shadows of things that will be? The shadows of things that may be? A visit to Scrooge's tomb is the climactic scene. Spirit, this is a fearful place. Tell 
tell me I may sponge away the writing on that stone. The virtual world is a learning environment where creativity is only limited by your imagination. How could you use a place like this to create a learning environment for your students?